I work at a frenetic pace. I don't know about you, but I find resting to be one of the most difficult things in my own life. I think this has to do with a culture that we've cultivated of work. What's really important about this is uh, in 2 Corinthians 5.17, God says that we are becoming in Christ, that when we follow Christ, when we're looking to be like Jesus, we're becoming a new creation. That the old is gone and the new is come. And the question that I've been asking is, what does the new look like? And I've been taking a page out of Genesis chapter one. It talks about like what the new is, how God created originally, because it'll help us know how God creates now. The principles are the same. God spends his time creating all sorts of amazing things, light and expanse and seasons and land and humanity. And then he rests. He rests. Day seven, I mean, to the Jewish people, the Sabbath is a really big deal. And I really have always just been a little bit dismissive of this because there's lots to do. There's like a lot of work to be done. So I haven't really cultivated sort of Sabbath tendencies in my life until I started reading about how important in the scriptures, how prominent this idea of resting was. And I started to ask myself, like, why is this such a big idea? And then it occurred to me that the only people who never rest are slaves. If you can never, ever stop working, if nothing can ever turn itself off, if you never really let go and let God, you never get to the end of yourself. It's more of you. It's more achieving. It's more function. It's more action. And that actually the Sabbath was this invitation to let God be God. To think, what would it look like in your life if there was a day where you weren't working? Would it all fall apart? Would everything collapse? Would everything go and you would be left with nothing? Or might God have you? Might God be able to sustain the universe and your life at the same time? See, the Sabbath is an invitation into the rhythm of God. It's an invitation into this idea that we're not just made to work all the time, that we're not just functional people, we're also relational people. But this is so difficult for us in a culture that never stops working. I mean, even just, I tried giving up our screens as a family one day. We call it screen-free day, just to try to create this less working. Maybe I didn't check my texts or my emails or my screens for a day. My teenager son called it damnation day. He hated it. We all went through detox and withdrawal. We just thought, what will happen? What will happen if we stopped working? And you know what happened? What happened was we found rest. We found rest and in that place where we stop striving and we stop working and we start functioning and we start paying attention to this beautiful relationship with God, we'll find the Sabbath invitation. We'll find God. We'll find rest for our weary souls. I hope that new creation in you has brought you to that place where you can find rest for your life.